Hi there, Ben here, and welcome to this tutorial in which we're going to do the song by Eddie Grant uh, from 1988, great year. Uh, Johanna, give me hope. Johanna, give me hope. Johanna, we can uh, strum it in two different ways. One that's a bit more drummy, like uh, the original song, and one that's a bit more ukulele-like, shall we say. So um, I'll just give you a little demo, and it's going to sound like this. First, there's the intro. <laughs> I mean, if you're alone, <laughs> it doesn't sound as nice if there's somebody behind you or with you with another ukulele doing the chords. Anyway, well, Joanna, she runs the country. She runs in the banality that's fire. She makes a few of her people happy. Oh, she don't care about the rest at all. Now the other strum, which is more drummy, more like the original. She's got a system that they call apartheid. It keeps a brother in the subjection. But maybe pressure will make Joanna see how everybody got to live as one. Oh, give me hope, Johanna. Hope, Johanna, give me hope, Johanna. Another couple of verses, or should we just start learning it now? You don't care. Okay, fine, fine. Well, that's good. Then I'll sing a couple more verses. I hear she makes all the golden money to buy new weapons and you shape our guns. While every mother in black so at all fears the killing of another son. Sneaking across all the neighbors' borders. Now enough that's okay good it's great song great song lots of fun to play it's so upbeat and a very powerful song in its time so we'll have a little look at the intro in a little bit but first of all we need three chords or four if you count the minor one and we're playing it in b flat which is the original key of the song so we need three two one one with the index and then we need e flat which is open three three one and then we need the dominant chord, the F. And whenever you feel like it, or whenever you want, or if you prefer, you can do an F or an F7 by adding your uh, ring finger here on the third fret of the C string. It just adds a little bit of. And then we need the E flat minor, which is a bit like an E flat, but we have to add our, to move everything down, and you play three, three, two, one. It's a bit like a D minor, but everything up a fret, E flat minor. So with the chords, well, Joanna, she runs a country. She runs in Dublin and the she makes a few of her people happy, oh! So you really need to be careful where the chords land, and then you're sorted for the whole song. She don't care about the rest at all. So, same chords for the entire song. What's going to be interesting to do, of course, is the strumming. But you need to just be mindful of the fact that always the E flat minor in every verse, it lands a tiny bit early. So it's not, she makes a few of her people happy. Oh, it's she makes a few of her people happy. Oh, she don't care. Okay, look, that's going to be more clear with the strumming pattern, of course, that we can have a look at now. So the easier one will just be a simple down, flourish, down, up, up, down, up, down. And make sure you've got this movement going on all the time. That's the most important thing to have is... A constant movement because if you're just focusing on arrows it will block your wrist and your arm and it the sound won't sound as flowing 
as it should and as groovy. It needs to groove here. So just everything loose and do do do. Always the same movement, except sometimes you hit the strings, sometimes not. And it's down, flourish up, up, down, up, down, flourish up. By flourish, I mean sort of you separate the fingers a bit. Not going like this, but like one, two, three, very quick. So. something maybe slightly different is that on the E B E B minor flat the E B minor flat lands on the up just after the flourish other people have and then we've got down down up down down up for B flat and F who only each lasts last two beats instead of four she don't care and then on to the second verse, not the chorus, as I just wanted to do. So that's your first drum that you can use, and it's more chillaxed, and it's nice to play it like this on the ukulele. But if you want something a bit more jambe y and by that I mean the drums of the original song, there's really lot, lots happening. And so you can play this with a faster dance drum. So you've got a down instead of once per beat, twice per beat, down, 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 not down, down, but down 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 and the strumming pattern is down 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 so slowly down 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 Last line B flat and F, they each get two beats, so they just get they don't down 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 up down up F down 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 up down up B flat down 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 up down up down 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 up. And also just before that on the E flat E flat minor, that's quite important. It's they make a few of her people happy. It's down 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 and on the fourth down E flat minor, and then down up down up after a little pause B flat. So slowly, she makes a few of her people happy. Oh, she don't care about the rest at all. She's not. Now, a little thing that we can add to this drumming pattern. Probably you want to add it after you've practiced it a bit, not yet. But if you've got it, something that you can do is you've noticed that the third strum is highlighted, so it has to be louder. Down, 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 But the strums after that, the quick ones, we can actually lift our fingers of the left hand a bit to mute the strings so it has a ting ding, kitty kitty king ding, kitty kitty king ding feel. And by this I mean down, down, So it's a bit like the loud strum is a trampoline on which you land with your fingers and then they bounce off slightly. So I'm going to exaggerate what I'm doing, but... So you see, it's like... And then they bounce off, and then they land again. So it's not so much on-off, it's more of a motion, and it doesn't really matter if you get it exactly right. It's just nice to have a slight difference in sound between the strums, so it organizes a bit for the brains of the people listening. Where's what and how does what groove how? Because it does groove a bit, but it's it's more of a motion, like a wheel more than an on-off switch. Well, Joanna, she runs the country. She runs in and the And you don't need to do it all the time, but it's a little something that you can add to change the flavour of each pattern sometimes, just to groove it up. Now, for everybody, let's do the chorus. Give me hope, give me hope. If you can't find the notes, uh, I'll, I'll sing it a bit lower actually because it's a bit high for me all of this. Um, if you can't find the notes, it's second fret, third fret of the C string and then first fret of the E string. Give me hope, Johanna, give me hope, Johanna, give me hope. Uh, let's do it with the first drumming pattern. <laughs> 
once, the chorus, and then the second, so you've got it both. And now the other strumming pattern. Actually, when I've got that ting ting ticket ticket ting ting ticket, I have the fingers of my right hand very close to the strings, and sometimes they're the ones doing the muting. So instead of having, I will have. So it's this sound here. It's the movement of my fingers because I'm pretty much strumming with all of these. Then staying close to the strings means that there's uh, a change in the sound also, which helps the groove. Give me just the chords. Give me. So there you go, you've got all the elements now and you can mix it up and choose whatever you prefer to do and whatever version you prefer and you can really make your own. So I'm giving you the ingredients but you do the cooking. Okay, that's quite nice, I think. And uh, feel free to share your dishes with the world and also with me, I'm happy to hear your covers. Okay, verses five and six. Mm, she's got supporters in higher places Putting their heads to the city sun Joanna give them the fancy money Oh, to tempt anyone who can She even knows how to swing a pinion In every magazine and the journals For every bad move that this Johanna makes They've got a good explanation Oh, give me hope, Johanna Oh, Johanna, give me hope, Johanna Intro. The intro fits on the same chords as um, we've got in the chorus, and it sounds like this. We start on 5 6 here. What's important is to basically know that you've got, uh, sorry, 6 5, 6 5, 8 6, and 10 8. And these are the three positions, or the three double notes, that we're going to play on for this whole thing. And it goes 1, 2, 3. So that's what happens on the chords that are already the chords of the chorus. Uh, it's really nice to play if you've got a friend on the ukulele, um, or, or just someone you know, or, or someone from your family, or basically a human being on a ukulele playing those chords, and then you can add these notes. And what's quite important to do is every time you change, for example, here, six, five, six, five, six, five, six, five, six, five, and then you've got eight, six, eight, six, eight, six. And what you want to do is, is glide as you land and especially here when you go on the 10-8 you, you don't want to play it like this you want to play it and the way to do that is to play it slightly before you arrive on the frets and to press down and glide up so really got the sound of the song. There you go, so with these tabs, basically now you have to work, you have to work, you have to practice. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching the whole thing, good job, and congratulations on your patience. And uh, feel free to go and get the document, of course, and support these tutorials. Um, thanks a lot for watching, see you soon for more, bye bye!